Hi everyone, how's the Sunday? I had a great day. I went out church and then after that I went to um I had lunch with my girl and then after that I had lunch with Celine, my best friend. So I have exciting exciting news as I promised to share with you how do I garner like 70 followers within a week. Um so I was she surprised by myself and I didn't and i was like uh i didn't really like uh, follow any gurus or something but i actually realized something uh this is what i do for the past one week do you want to know okay so um this is the um uh, okay as we all know like um there's a lot of changes on instagram and then uh i realized that if you always um key in the same hashtags okay they actually have some shadow bans on some hashtags so you need to take note of that So I written my notes on how to um have followers uh within one week how I do it okay so uh let me give you a little bit background about myself so basically I am a style coach uh for about 10 years I'm doing like direct sales also for 10 years um and then I've done a lot of uh grooming for corporates uh like UOB like uh NTU like SIM Um, I do for Skill Future, which is the government related, um, uh, which is like a government related um, credit kind of uh, courses that I do, um, and then I do for um, Citibank. I do for a lot of companies actually, Changi Hospitals and hospitals. I do grooming for them, and then after that, I went on to. I used to be from fashion beauty industry, so I've been uh, fashion beauty industry for about eighteen years. Um, and I'm very strong in marketing and PR, so that's my strength. So then after that, I I got tired of doing marketing for many many years, so that's why I went on to uh, doing Mary Kay, a direct sales company, for about ten years. And then after that, in two zero one two to two zero one four, I became the top sales person in Mary Kay in Singapore and Malaysia. So I was very um, I thank God for. Um, Giving me favor with my friends, my companies, uh, companies that approach me to do classes. All glory to God for giving me this favor with people, and then I became top sales for the next three years consecutively. So recent years, I have been、uh, thinking about my direction on what I want to be next. You know, I wanted to be a personal branding and style ex- coach as well. So right now, I actually revamp a few of my clients. You know, like because some of them are promoted to become VP in their companies, and some of them are professors in their universities. You know, they actually hire me to do a revamp of their wardrobe. Because we always talk about like a first impression counts, right? It's all about appearance, behavior, and communication. So the first thing first, what I do is I help them to improve their appearance, improve their styling, and then after that, next I help them to improve their behavior. You know the way they are.、Uh, you know, like、um, in terms of like,、uh, do they communicate correctly according to their corporate culture? Do they behave according to their corporate culture? And then whether they can gel into their corporate culture. Then after that comes the communications. Whether you can create a presence. To convey your messages during the meetings, you know. So that's what I do. That's why I help a lot of women,、uh, especially on how they create a presence when they do a presentations. Because some of the customers they actually told me, like Julia, I have problems conveying、uh, messages because I have problems creating a presence in front of my colleagues. I used to be a、um, executive. Right now, I'm actually a manager. You know, how do I change that? So I actually help a lot of. People to improve their presence,、uh, presentation as well. When it comes to uh, presenting, uh, when they want to present and they want to convey their messages across to the board, yeah. So that's what I do. So right now, I am improving myself constantly. You know, when you're alive, right? We all, you know, wanted to learn and improve ourselves often. So I wanted to improve myself and also improve my social media presence. So that's why I would. I tried this for about three weeks, and the first week I didn't get much followers. I get like maybe one follower. The second week I tried again. I get about two, three followers.、Um, the third week I got like seventy followers a week. So I'm gonna tell you what do I do to change my、uh, the way I do my presentation in my Instagram. So first of all, I think it's very important that you know、uh, you have to improve on your bio. So the next time I will I will let you know how to,、uh, the next video I will teach you how to improve your bio, 
And then um, what I do is improvement of engagement. Engagement is the key. So I do a lot of makeup tutorials to engage my clients, to engage my audience on Instagram. And then I engage my followers as well. So when I see each, each time someone uh, like uh, or follow my, my Instagram post, you know, I actually uh, text them and thank them for uh, following my uh, to, to like you know following my Instagram and then I also um, in my post I actually ask questions in my captions right uh, so that I involve uh, interaction interactive session with them 